namaste. Good afternoon, everybody. Here you, go. you guys, oh my goodness. I cannot believe this. Look outside. It is sunny. It's not raining for the first time in I don't even know how long, but I'm stuck inside doing homework. Mark my words, we are going outside today. We have to. We're doing it. Okay, you guys, if I'm being honest with you, I did not finish my homework, but I think I'm making the executive decision to be a bad student and just push that stuff to later because we need to catch this sun right now. Who knows when it's going to start raining? Probably any minute. We need to take advantage of this opportunity and get our vitamin D before it's gone, <laughs> honestly. But before I do that, I think I'm going to water my plants because... They're looking kind of dry. Ooh. This thing is from Ikea. I use distilled water to water my plants. I don't know if you're supposed to, but they like it, I think. I think I'll water this one later. Uh, I think it's good. It's kind of dry, yeah. We can do this. This one. All right, so usually after I water the plants, I mist them. Do it right here as well. I don't know if it helps, but apparently it does. With like humidity this thing's really cool like i'm like pressing it and then it continues to spray i'm honestly just making my whole room wet but i just wanted to show you guys Is today Wednesday? Yeah. Students, 10% discount. Oh shit. California almost? Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Cashews. Literally right where we need them. We have the almond milk, we have the nutritional yeast, almonds, cashews, we have the bell pepper. That's it. <laughs> Seriously? This is the recipe, you guys. But I'll teach you how to make it later. I wrote this. Huh? I wrote this recipe. It notes. Yeah, but you got this recipe from somewhere, probably. I wrote it out. <laughs> Chia seeds. Chia seeds. Let's go. Chia seeds. Dude, bulk barn is like IG worthy. Like yes. they got good lighting. They got like aesthetic like signs. Everything's labeled. <laughs> Should I get some of this? Sevia? You probably need some. I get this one. It's more expensive, so I always write this down. <laughs> bulk barn life hack guys. If you want the stevia. 
Right, two eight eight nine. Right, two three five. Can this be A pound is only two dollars. Stella's gonna go nuts. Would you like your seat? Yeah. 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 Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Oh my goodness. We were there for like ten minutes and it's literally dark out now. Told you guys. Sun's gone. It's gonna start raining. Third store. That's what we need. This one's the best store. Oh, this one's good. Two for three. Yeah. Off the goods. So this is what the camera looks like in low light. How's it look? It's pretty good actually. Yeah. Right? Yeah. That's sick. Fox is like that. All right. Time to go home and whip up some. What do you I call don't think it? it is. Vegan cheese. Mmm, crunchy. <laughs> All right, welcome to Cooking with Ira. <gasps> Anyways, we are making vegan cheese. What you are going to need is... <gasps> Dude, your phone, your hiccups, like... We're rolling right now. So first, you're gonna want to put one cup of almond milk. So for the almond milk, you gotta make sure that it is unsweetened, the original version, because you don't want like vanilla tasting cheese dip. So get the original, unsweetened, just regular almond milk. And you just want to put a cup of this stuff. And then you're gonna need 15 grams of nutritional yeast, rich in vitamin B12. This stuff's really good for you. This is the secret, like you need, you need this. Like if you don't like this stuff, then don't make this cheese. Cause this is like what makes it cheese, but fake. See, vegan approved, it's on there. Non-GMO, gluten-free, all that stuff. One fourth cup of this stuff. So around that much. And then once you have that, you're gonna want to add raw almonds. If your blender's not that strong, then don't put the almonds in the blender. You should soak the almonds first so that they're kind of soft. Soak them in water overnight and then put them in. It'll be softer for your blender and easier, but this blender can take it. We need half a cup of this. Half a cup, thank you, sir. Or 70 grams in the blender goes. And then we're gonna do the same thing with the cashews. Can we soak these as well or no? Don't soak these. Basically, if you don't have a blender that can blend cashews, then buy a new blender. Yum. And then this, we need this, right? You wanna put a whole red pepper, a quarter of an onion. So we're putting five cloves of garlic. You can put more, you can put less if you don't like garlic. If you don't like onion, don't put onion. This is your recipe now. Now we are gonna add the spices. We like pink Himalayan salt. It doesn't really matter. Just put like a pinch, two pinches maybe. Crushed chili peppers. If you like it spicy, go off and put the whole bag. Okay, now we gotta blend it. All right, you guys, so if you have a Vitamix, you wanna start it on low and then wrap it up to high. Once it's on high, you wanna blend it for six minutes. You want it to be like this smooth consistency at the same time, it will start to get warm. If you have any other blender, then you just wanna blend it until it's this consistency and then you can heat it up in the microwave if you want it to be warm. This is the consistency that you want. It's gonna look like a cheesy queso vegan dip. Just like that. It's 
So some of my favorite things that I like to eat this with, one, I'm not vegan, so I eat pepperoni with it. It just tastes so good together. I don't have pepperoni right now. I only have some tortilla chips. These are good. Raw veggies are a good one if you want to be like super healthy. Mmm. This is what it looks like, you guys. Mmm. Okay, y'all. Uh, this combination is honestly so good. Successful. It's dark out. My neighbor's lights on. I don't know if this is weird, but I always leave my blinds open. I just like the light shining in. But then like my neighbor's house, I don't know if you guys can even see it through the reflection. My neighbor's house is literally right across and this light is always on. But I never see like their blinds are always closed, so I just leave mine open. But if they open their blinds, we can literally make eye contact. And that's kind of weird. But yeah, hi neighbor. Hope you guys enjoyed my very first day in the life. More to come for sure. Super fun filming on the iPhone 12 Pro Max. If any of you guys are wanting to buy the iPhone for the camera, definitely recommend it. Super good quality. But first video of 2021. 2021 is gonna be our year. It's gonna be the best year of our lives because you guys are going to chase your dreams. You guys are going to apply what you learned from 2020 onto this year. You can do that thing you keep putting off. Go out and do it today instead. You're gonna start it. Who cares what people think? Come on, you guys. Time is precious. Time is waiting for nobody. 2020 taught us that. Go out, get yours. Be good people and 2021 will treat you well. I, prom I guarantee that. So thanks for listening to my TED talk. I'll see you guys in my next video.